hey, lamp oil. Anything else behind this box? No. Looks like there's some sort of symbol on this box. Possibly writing, I'm not sure. Can't really read it. Alright. Well. Ugh. What in the world? How did that stuff just suddenly appear there? That was strange. Well, it doesn't seem to have messed with my sanity very much. If at all. Why is this window boarded up? So many questions, so little answers. Alright, well, we'll try the wine cellar. Maybe that's where that noise came from. I don't know if it's a good idea to figure out where that noise came from. I guess I can't light that. It's locked and it will not open without a key. Alright. Guessing that went under my mementos. Find the key for the wine cellar. The laboratory. Hmm. Alright. A fragrant taste of rose lingered in his mouth. Turkish delights, he thought. Just like the ones at the consulate at Constantinople. dark in here. Ah, torch. Perfect. Hmm. Oh, if this is supposed to be a laboratory, what in the world? Just, uh... It, uh, it almost seems like something breathing. Which is mildly creepy, because that would have to be a very big something to make that ruckus. Nothing. Ugh. What is that? Uh oh. Losing sanity again. You. Is that flesh or something? Might just be squished apples. I'm hoping it's the latter. Hmm. It's, uh, it sounds like there might be someone else in here. Not sure. I don't see anything over here. Under the bowl? Play a little game with uh, the bowls. Find the tinder box under one of the bowls. Win five. Ooh, what's this? What is this? Ah, some oil. Lovely. Ah, uh, don't really see anything else. see that before. Is that me, or...? I can't tell. I will be right back in just a moment. And here we are again. It, uh, it would seem that it was not me that was making that, that noise. Is not an openable chest. Ooh. Hey there. Come on, give me that. I do like having tender boxes. Is there anything else over here? No. Ooh. Haha. -ha. It looked too small to be a proper chest, but uh, apparently it was. I'm just walking around. 
is that? There's like nothing down there to be making that little splashing. Strange. I wonder if the the shadow that he's talking about is fear. Insanity. Aww. No voice acting for this. Oh well. The lack of a chimney to properly vent the fumes from my most recent experiments has taken its toll on many of my less stable ingredients in storage. Some seem unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes and will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can to move them to the wine cellar. Hmm. So he's putting chemicals in the wine cellar. But, uh, I need to find a key for that wine cellar. Ooh, that boil. What is this? Uh, just possibly some ink or maybe even booze. I don't know. It's like, uh, tiny scrolls, maybe? Uh oh. My, my lamp seems to have gone out. There we go. Well, it, it seems to run out a lot faster than... What was that? There should be more Kubrak. Let me see, let me see. And one part Aquaforce. about a chemist of some sort that might have been here. Looks like uh, some ingredients perhaps. Nothing particularly useful around here. What about behind these? No. Alright then. Aha! Tender box. How lovely. What is this? Chemistry pot. What do we have here? Uh, early alchemy experiment. This is my third attempt to produce artificial vitae. Uh, the former compo er, uh, compounds lacked the potency I need, but I sense I'm close. Uh, calamine and... Uh, Orpiment are a given, <clears throat> and the uh, coprite binds them well. This time I will attempt aqua regia, uh, regia, instead of aqua fortis, in hope it will produce a more even solution. The experiment was unsuccessful. The solution is highly acid, it should be acidic. I, well, I suppose highly acid could... whatever. Anyways, and proves impractical to put to any use, except as a detergent. So maybe I could dissolve that uh, strange goo, fleshy stuff. Uh, organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution. Ah, there we are. And should be handled with the greatest care. I might be able to use the recipe, but I'm losing hope that I will find an alchemic solution to my predicament. Hmm. Well, hint, move the mouse while holding down the left mouse in order to move the object. What what object are they talking about? And what is making me so scared over here? Is it just the light? Or am I losing lots of sanity? What is this? One day I will return if it wasn't for the thought of you, my love. I wouldn't be able to go on. When I find myself doing terrible things, I take comfort in you. As long as I am able to think of you and long for life together, I know I'm better than the others. I weep for them. They 
lust for power without restraint, where I only crave fair judgment and a safe return. This looks much like the save points in Penumbra. I'm guessing that's what they're meant to be. Um, well, I don't really see anything else around here worth exploring. This is a very strange looking grate. Seems like someone was trying to make some sort of ornate looking thing instead of just a regular grate. I don't know why. Hmm. Well, I don't know how to make that acidic solution that they were talking about. Because there was no recipe. So that's not particularly helpful. I don't really see anything in here. There's some strange groaning going on. Getting closer, somehow. Closer? Closer to what? And who's whispering to me? Talking about getting closer to this? I don't know. I feel something is being missed around here. Something. Just don't know what. Like, possibly a key to the wine cellar or something like that. How's my lantern oil doing? It's, it's still pretty high so far. I feel like there must be something down here that I'm, that I'm not seeing. I don't know. The only place I can think of going to after this is, is the archive. There's not much else to find around here as far as I know. Hmm. Unsure. Nothing under this. Oh! Well. Takes care of uh, using my lantern over here. No. Just random bottles with X's on them. Probably not very good to drink. But what if I'm thirsty? What am I supposed to drink? Alright, well... I feel I've... more or less examined the area. If there's something else, I don't know about it. I suppose we're leaving. Wine cellar is the next place we need to go to. The other children cheered him on, his name voiced in a steadily rising pace, urging him to do it. Am I ready to do this? The young boy thought and struck his victim with a rock. That's kind of creepy. Alright, well. Up to the, uh. The only other place I could think of. Unless there's something here. No. Alright, to the archive then. And that was a locked door down there, I believe. He fell to the kitchen floor. Tears were beginning to well in his eyes as he received the first kick in his stomach. Hazel remained hidden in fear she would be punished. She too would be punished. Hmm. Kind of a dreary, dark feeling I'm getting from this story here. <laughs> 